What's up beautiful beings and welcome back to Improved Humanity Games where today I'm showing you how to build a party in Insanity Fife. Now specifically speaking, when I say building a party, I mean leveling it up to a point in which you can use Gift Box, Fortune Drop, and Linked Attack, which are the most commonly used uh, party skills. I don't even think any of these are used by anyone I've ever seen at all, ever, you know, in eternity, everything. I've never, ever seen anything used. <laughs> I was going to draw that out so much, but anyways, yes, these three skills, Linked Attack, Fortune Drop, and Gift Box, they're pretty much the only three that are used, and you have to get it up to, like, past level 25 or something like that to get all of these, or past level 30, and you're, you want to uh, get points by leveling it up. So, first things first, I did forget a scroll that levels it up to level 10 immediately. You can find that in the scroll shop. Uh, it's Scroll of Party Advanced or something like that, and it gets your uh, party to level 10 right away. And then you can change it to the uh, advanced party and continue leveling it. But since I don't have that and I forgot it, just completely blanked out, I'm going to show you guys how to level up your party very quickly. And uh, where I'm at, I'm in the Decane Dungeon, which is in Darken. And uh, this is just a random room. You don't necessarily have to do it in this specific room. Um, and currently, I'm just running around with my head chopped off because I'm trying to commentate. And I'm not doing very well at it. Well, it's your you're the judge, I guess. But anyways, any any place that you can kill uh, mobs, you're going to level up the party, obviously. But there's one little catch here. I don't know uh, if you have to do it this way, but a friend has told me that the best way to do it is with the level 1 leecher. So he is level 1 right here. Uh, this is a friend of mine, Z-Smash, as you probably know. If you've seen my uh, previous videos, one of his characters, he's just helping me make this video. So he's got a character that is just sitting there and... Uh, leveling up the party because you do need at least two people within the vicinity to level up the party. So let's see if we can get to level 10 here. I'm going to use this and this just because I can. And we are level, let's see, increase to level 10. Very good. Now I can change it to advanced party farming day 2.0. Farming day 2.0 because it's not, ah, you can't do that. Farming day 2. Let's go. Okay, so this is what I find to be the best way to level up your party. I'm going to level it up to about level 35. I might speed it up, I might not. Um, but I do want to talk about something that is not related to uh, creating this party leveling video. And that is that people have been adding me recently that there's a lot of additions to my friend list, I guess you could say. And uh, I'm not quite sure how I want to deal with that because... You know, I, I like helping people out and everything like that, and uh, I don't mind having friends, but eventually the friends list is going to be filled up, fold up, filled up, whatever, and uh, it's going to get obnoxious. So if I do end up allowing or continuing to add people, I might just have to turn off my chat and uh, restrict it so I don't get spammed, but uh, otherwise I'll have it on if... if you know, I'm doing some sort of event or something that'll keep it on. So I'm not quite sure what I'll do with that. If you don't have any, like, dire questions or something like that, don't add me. Unless, again, you have a crazy question that you need to ask me. Um, but otherwise, just PM me if you need to. Slash say. How do you do that? It's slash say. And then my name. And then it'll pop up on my screen and then I can talk to you. So you don't necessarily have to add me to, to contact me. But, you know, just letting you guys know, if I do end up getting a full friends list or if I feel like I'm getting spammed and I have to put it on to, uh, to uh, restricting my chat so no one can talk, then uh, just understand I'm not being a dick. I'm just kind of helping my own sanity. So, yes, we're leveling up the party. How are you guys doing? This is a pretty good place to do it because there's a ton of mobs that spawn and the more mobs, obviously, the better. And another thing that is important to note is that this uh, filler guy, he can actually die. So don't feel like you have to come back every time he dies. Since getting a level 1 back here isn't the most convenient, even though you can teleport. It's still probably pretty slow and that sort of thing. So, uh, hmm. Let's see. What else? wonder what level this party is at. But yes, I just need to let you guys know that uh, if things do get a little hectic, I'm not being mean or, or ignoring you guys. But I am 
trying to continue my sanity and that sort of thing. So, let's see what the party level is after this. Whoops, whoops, whoops. After this, uh, after this AOE. So obviously, whenever I do any of the farming videos or any of the gathering that you know that requires gathering, I like to use a an Arcanist because they have Blizzard and that thing freaking rounds them up like cattle and sheep in a farm. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what that analogy is. Um, okay, let's see. Boom. What level are we? I'm actually gonna level this up to a decent amount because I'm probably gonna use it because later today we're gonna be farming uh, bosses. Bosses. I think it is level 25 and at level 30 you probably get that one. But this is nice. So I got all these and I have 390 points and as you level it up again the points will increase. Uh, I'm not sure like the rate. Maybe it's like 10 points per level or something like that or 15 points per level. Not quite sure. But uh, yeah. So I hope you guys thought this video was helpful enough. I mean, I never knew that you could do this. I knew you could level up party, obviously, but I didn't know that you could uh, level it up with a level one leecher or a filler and uh, get it this quickly. So that's pretty nice. Um, if you want to just dual log it, you can do that, obviously. But since I'm recording, it does take a little bit more energy from my computer, so I don't necessarily want this thing to crash on me. And it gets a little bit more hectic, obviously, with two different accounts going. So, uh, yes, I hope this video is helpful. Thank you guys so much for watching. A like would be much appreciated. And continue checking out the channel because more epic videos are going to be coming on this game as well as uh, other games, uh, random games as well as Minecraft. So this is kind of like a, an update video in a sense that I'm talking about a bunch of random stuff now. But uh, preventing the continuation of my speech, I am going to literally say one word after that one word and after this sentence and continuing on to saying more sentences over and over oh my gosh why do i do this i ramble so much hey what up dude what up dude he just flying through man what up dude okay yes he go bye bye i go bye bye as well adios hope you guys thought this was helpful like would be uh, much appreciated again thank you guys so much subscribe all that good stuff bye i'll show you guys what i do uh, this obviously isn't as much as you can use. You can probably put on like 20 different things that you can get from quest boxes, like little, uh, you can use those Easter eggs that are from a recent event, or you could use fly for fun cards, fly.